Hey, hey, good morning. Yeah, I just got a call. Uh, there is a uh, American Rotary phase converter going to be here in 20 minutes. So uh, I'll see if I can put the camera out there and uh, see it unloaded off the truck. It'd be kind of cool. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Machine shop thing I got going here. Mm -hmm. I retired from it and I can't get away from it. But well, you know, it keeps you busy and keeping keep busy is good. Yeah. yeah we, uh, we had a lot of fun in the back of that truck. We would kick, they would throw us all in there in the back. And well, my wife and I did the same thing. Yeah, we that was our only vehicle. We um, <laughs> we would all jump in the freaking back, and you know, they would go fishing and uh, great memories, you know. Hey, that's why I look at the truck. I just think, yeah, we did a lot of things. And there'd be about six, seven of us just <laughs> rolling in the back of there all the freaking time. And the old three on the tree, reverse, first, second, third. Yeah, yeah. You know, they had the old straight somewhere, and that's old street. It, Straight six lasted forever. Yeah, yeah. We uh, we had the earlier two sixteen, and it went out. And the only person in town who could fix it retired, so we put a little later two thirty five, mm -hmm. and it had the four speed. Mm -hmm. But it didn't have to really do anything. Well, the, the, well my uncle says he goes, "It's just straight six. There ain't nothing wrong." Yeah. You know, it, it's it lasted. For a long time, my cousin got it right now, and uh, he, he wants to put a little 327 in it, and you know, and but no, it's a good truck, it's a beautiful freaking truck, you know, reliable. We had a good time with in, in, in those trucks. But you have a wonderful day. Well, thank you very much. All right. Bye bye. Yep. It's here. Uh, Chloe has to inspect the uh, new arrival here and uh, it looks like they didn't stack anything on top of it so uh, I guess it's time to open it up
out back pretty good. Didn't see any kind of damage there. My goodness. Well, the Gomer Pile 1 rotary phase converter I built failed. And I had the the Goober Pile 1A. Man, that's a big, big motor there. That's amazing. Okay, I guess that's a, a 15 horsepower motor that should well over cover the uh, five horsepower maximum I have. Oh. Okay, let's see what's in here. I bet this is a control box. We'll get this mounted pronto too, huh? We have a yellow feet kit. And the manual. Now, I'm a person that reads manuals. Most people don't do anything like that. <laughs> and I'm good at reading manuals too, and a lot of people aren't. You know, a guy hired me once to, to help him on a job because I was good at reading manuals. I'm not kidding you. And it was for uh, uh, German-made uh, restaurant equipment that was being put in a school. Look at that. That is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful there. Uh. Well, I'm going to have to... Here, I'll put it on a tripod keep going for a while. Here we go. Look at the trees. <laughs> okay. Let's get this plastic here. Okay. I'll tell you what, this thing's going to get a, a tremendous amount of use. They have uh, an awful lot of stuff to show you guys. Can't get anyone else to do it, so everybody's afraid of the bullies. Okay. Okay, this will, uh, of course, I'll have to look at the instruction manual. Holy cow. I, I didn't have anything like this uh, uh, going for the uh, Goober Pile A1 converter I was uh, designing. This looks pretty nice. Look at the start stop button right there. All right. Now what I got to do is I'm going to mount this on the wall. So I'll take a couple strips of oak and go across the uh, studs so I can hang this thing. It's, it's uh, I don't know, 10 or so pounds. 12 pounds, I don't know. I don't think it's <laughs> as heavy as a KDK tool post. That motor's a chunk, though, I'll tell you that. Holy cow, that's a big motor. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll shuffle stuff around, and uh, I think I'll go ahead and load this so you can see uh, that it did arrive. Okay, back soon.